Today, the January 6th investigators um, released this, released video and still images of Republican Congressman Barry Loudermilk, in fact, leading that group on an hours long tour of all three House office buildings on January 5th. Hours in all three office buildings where members of Congress have their offices. And one member of the group strangely takes pictures of things that Tourists don't typically take pictures of security checkpoints and hallways and stairways. It has begun here at the Washington Monument, Washington, D.C. Say hello to Facebook. Hey, what's going on, man? Glad this to be a, here, bro. This is our fearless leader. Hey, baby. Let's him. Go. Check out my flag I made, guys. You see it? There you go, baby. <laughs> That's for a certain person. That's right. That's for somebody, somebody special. Somebody special. What's up, everybody? Major Retired Richard Ojeda here. And we've heard about the members of the Treason Caucus giving tours of the Capitol building on January the 5th, a day before the deadly coup attempt. These tours were nothing more than these vile anti-American cosplayers running reconnaissance as to how they can sack the Capitol the next morning and turn America into a fascist state. The January 6th commission is shedding light on Representative Barry Loudermilk stories. The scumbags he welcomed into our nation's capital under his name were seen on video the next day carrying makeshift weapons and threatening violence. You know, the violence that the Republicans are so shocked to see and are utterly astonished that could possibly happen. And think about it. This whole thing is a quintessential Republican move. There's no escape, Pelosi. Schumer. Nadler. We're coming for you. We're coming in like white on rice for Pelosi, Nadler, <laughs> Schumer, even you, AOC. We're coming to take you out. Loudermilk didn't carry the weapon, but there's definitely blood on his hands. Convenient that his trained monkeys take the fall for him, and he talks his way out of a prison sentence. These politicians really deserve these people's loyalty. They were made for one another. The ignorant and violently hostile paired with soulless and exploitive opportunists. And make no mistake, the Loudermilk treason tour is coming to light now, but it's only a drop in the ocean of right-wing treachery. Green, Boebert, Gates, Gosser, Biggs, and Gomert were also heard about giving these treason tours. And do you think those political slime stains hold themselves to a higher virtue of integrity than louder milk? Well, if you do, your brain is past corruption. These snakes will fight tooth and nail to keep the truth from coming out. Perhaps the best thing a politician can offer is transparency, and that is the thing the treason caucus works to prevent with every action. Remember a little while back when Louis the Scumbuck at Gobert was whining to the media that Republican lawmakers can't even lie to Congress or lie to the FBI? Yeah. You're not supposed to be able to do that, you corrupt fascist weasel. Where in your oath did you swear to lie, cheat, murder, and steal in the name of political power and against American democracy? So while these vermin work to hide their crimes, their intentions are crystal clear. They want to seize power for themselves at all costs, destroying America, complicit in murder, lies, treason, and contempt. All acceptable means to an end of anointing themselves rulers over mindless, willing slaves. But that's their weakness. They need suckers to back them up. They need morons who will crusade to their death in the name of their hero, corrupt politicians. And it makes me puke that they found such people. These devils have come out of the woodwork. White supremacists and neo-Nazis that were shunned by society and embraced by the treason caucus. A sea of willing pawns to do their master's evil bidding, simply because hatred blinds their every action. That's why we've got to pay attention to these hearings. We've got to see American justice come through and save this country. And we've got to reach every person, every friend, every neighbor we know, and delete this alt-right polluted thinking from our culture forever. Demand these traitors are held accountable and expose the plots to destroy our country from within. Barry Loudermilk and his fellow members of the Treason Caucus are enemies to this nation, period. Sappers clear the way, airborne all the way.